<laughs> this ain't like gonna be some rah rah motivational bull. Not my fault, it is my fault. We in a different city. I don't even know where we're at. Arizona, I think. Let me know if you guys can hear me. Type yes if you can hear me. He never lets me just share one note. Wins and he wins. Man, I know I know there's been some wins because I see in the group. His name escapes me right now, man. But he said he made he made 6k in his first month. It's the first time he ever posted in a group, he posted a video. That's dope. Let's just talk about the group before before I get into the lessons. Just want to talk about any struggles you guys have with the, with the groups because it's an amazing strategy, man. Like if you can get it, it's just something about it because everybody has kind of like raised their hand to say you guys should have been booking calls out the groups or getting sales out the groups in the first week. Has anybody done that? It has 130 people in his Facebook group. That's lit. Better if I take all my heart and nothing's gonna tear us apart. Several song filled hours later. With this flip phone, which is pretty impressive. He brings us as well, getting more job advice and ended up building a following of over 2 million fans on his YouTube and Facebook pages. His videos have been viewed well over 100 million times. He's also the author of several best selling books on Amazon, including The Ultimate Cuts. And in 2013, he started his own supplement company, Grow Laboratory. So please join me in welcoming Brandon to the proposing stage of the church. Thank you. Screenshot she sent yesterday. They won't. They won't believe it if I just say it. You wanna go around to show everybody the <laughs> screenshot? Fuck it. Here's the method. I'm gonna teach you the method that we use. The whole day should be planned out, including family and friends, spouses, significant others, especially if that's important to you. Anything important you should be in calendar. Brats and everything, but here's my business card. Okay. I would love to talk to you about coaching. I'm in I'm in Train Fitness magazine. Tell me, yo, tell me, man. Yeah. Yo, let's I would like to talk to you about that more, man. Yeah, like, yeah. You, like we can talk, let's schedule a little call, man. You got I would love to do it. Let's talk to my man, my man Mike. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, great nice, to you, man. Nice, nice to meet you. No problem, man. Chris, great great to meet you, bro. How you doing? Good, man. Checking it out. I'm like, my buddy Weatherford shows it has a picture of you. Yeah, yeah. Steve's a good friend of mine. Yeah, Steve's Steve's a good dude. Are you based in California? I'm in New York. Yeah, that's how I'm at Steve, you know, New York. Since we look like brothers here, brothers from another mother. Are you flying back today? Uh, no, tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Yeah, yeah, tomorrow. We'll see you soon. All right, thanks, man, bro. Thanks. Awful. Gut wrenching. A lot of it was me. I probably should have prepared. I could have did better. But at the same time, I didn't care because I like that was like soon like soon I saw the crowd, I was like I didn't care, so I was like fuck it. That was good. I thought you were good. For real? Yeah. <laughs>
Let me pull my iPhone out of his ass. <laughs> That's the punchline. <laughs> Go. <laughs> I don't think this is gonna make the vlog. <laughs> Are there stakes? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is the Lewis Howe School of Greatness oh, match. They're talking about the mask of masculinity, how we just, we just cover ourselves. We don't, we don't show our true selves. We're too afraid what people are gonna think of us. There's this one guy there named Scott. He's kind of like a, he's kind of like a big ripped dude, you know? Kind of like me. I was like, yo, man, you really follow this? Like, nah, man, this shit is gay. It's like, yeah, man, I agree, this shit is weird. I don't really buy this woo woo kind of shit. The one thing I do buy, so you, you gotta believe in yourself. It's like, yeah, I agree, I agree. You gotta believe in yourself. You know, I wanted to like connect with him a little more. So I'm like, yo, man, you like you like to fuck bitches? You like to fuck bitches? He's like, yeah, yeah, man, I definitely do. I definitely do. In fact, pulls my iPhone out of his ass. He says, just match with this hot girl. That's all I got. Did you like attend any sessions that were good? We just had dinner with us, some guys, some business with before. It's cool, you know. Uh, we're just linking up with him, man. You know, networking. And now we're about to go get some rest. We gotta wake up early, five, and back to New York City. Yeah.